Just waiting for it. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to me. I don't know why I'm doing this. Yeah. So enough acting like a prat, my name is Jordan, welcome back to the channel. Yeah, if you've not noticed by that, it's my birthday today, I turned 16. And what better to spend my birthday than watching town. It's going to be MK Dons at home as well. Oh god. I mean, we are beaten against MK this season, we drew at Stadium MK, we beat them in the FA Cup, so that's why I got a good away day at Crystal Palace. But no, just imagine if we get another result out of them. Oh my. But yeah, thank you for the continued support on the channel. Let's just get straight to Blundell Park, shall we? Let's get to Blundell Park. Let's get some team news. Let's get three points. And I'm going to celebrate my birthday in style. Come on, town. A few moments later. So we're still outside Blundell Park for today's game against MK Dons. We're here with Luca Quarter, who's an Hello. MK Dons fan. So Luca, how do you feel about today's game? Well, I look into this game right is that we've lost um, our form a little bit. Like we've lost the last couple of games. We lost to Berry 4-3, we were 3-1 up. And then we lost to Crew last week. But we're not really, really on good form. Both teams are not really going into this form. And I look at this game, this is a must, must, must win now because we're fifth in the league. The league is so tight now, but it's a massive, massive win for us because we've got winnable games. And I'm gonna judge us in the next three games whether we're good enough to go up this season because I generally think we've got a very, very good chance of going up. I, I think the league is so tight yeah. and I think we're going to get the win today because obviously yeah. Tisdale knows, he knows that we have to come here. Yes, Grinsby are a very, very good side at home. I looked at your, your research of that, you were on good form and not now, you're not really on good form but I'm going to go for a 2-1 win. I think we can go here and obviously um, nick, nick a result. I think it's going to be a really, really tight game. It's going to be a really, really good entertaining League 2 football this afternoon and that's it. Yeah, exactly. I, I reckon it'll be good game to good football insights as well. So, yeah, like I said, I think as well, go and check it out. Um, I, I reckon they might nick it, but um, we'll have to see. I mean, hopefully it'll be some good football play. I mean, the two decent sides. And yeah, let's see how the game takes us. So, so Luca, thank you very much for your time. Best of luck for the game. Thank you and also, much. best of luck for your season as well. Yeah, thank, thank you very you much. Very much. All right, Bundle Park, team news is in. Elliot Embleton's back in the team. Martin Wolford's yeah. back in and we've also brought back Jordan Cook, surprisingly enough. I think Harry Cadwell's got a bit of a knock. But um, it's a good lineup. We've got Joseph Kewin still suspended, so we've still got Sam Russell in goal. Um, yeah, it's going to be one hell of a tough game, I'll give you that. Let's go, come on. Oh, offside. Still missed. I'm out. Stop. Stop. Oh, I have to Can we get another crossing? Let's go, go. No, I don't think we're going to get Someone help him out. Is out the goals again, and how many goals out is over? It's good to be on MK nil. Come on! Oh! Oh! It's one of God's sake, it's another red. Don't know. I need to see that. 
It did look like a red card. Oh, it's going to go down for me, I can see. Red card, it's for Harry Davis, looks like. MK have got free kick. Oh! Elliot Embleton. So it's half time, Grimsby 1, MK 0. Almost. The brilliant half, we were excellent in that half. MK, I'm going to be honest, didn't look much threatening at all. They had a few decent chances, but not great. We, we've just been brilliant. We've a chance that we've gone 1 0 up, thanks to West Thomas. I say nearly the brilliant half. That red card doesn't help anything, it looks like a red. Sophia saying that. Pulled a short stamp, but I don't know. But it's some, it was something like that. But if we could keep it up in the second half, I would we'll get some points out of this game for sure. But as an MK fan, I'd really think we need to step up because, on the whole, they've been poor. They've had a lot of possession, like don't get me wrong, but I've not done enough much with it. If I'm going to be honest, expecting a bit more from MK. But um, but we're down to some men. So let's see in the second half. Let's see if we can. <laughs> Well, plays well as the first half, I'd say. Give it up, Tom. Going well. Off we go. Clear it. Naughty! On the rebound! On the rebound! You play five minutes, these are all over at the minute. Oh, brilliant tackle. That is brilliant. Oh, no. No. Fun, wasn't it? <laughs> so the game finished, Grimsby Town won, MK on nil. We've beaten MK again. God, we're good against these at home. But uh, no, um, first half we looked brilliant attacking, second half we practically parked the bus. We defended really well. I thought um, MK was unlucky not to get something out of the game, to be completely honest. They did play well at parts. And yeah, I mean, sometimes you got to win, you got to win the tough way, and we did that. 
thanks to Wes Thomas's header in the first half. And we did it with 10 men, I keep forgetting about that. Harry Davis's red card. My next game will be on, on the channel will be next week where we play Newport at home. Before I end the video, make sure you go subscribe to Luca Quarter, that MK Dons fan that I interviewed earlier. Go and check him out, he's a good YouTuber. And yeah, let's give him some subscribers. So thank you guys for watching. Um, make sure you hit that like, like button, subscribe if you're new. My name is Jordan, I'll see you in my next vlog until then. Peace.